Hi, Steve here from Avdor. I'd like to talk to you today about ComHPC. ComHPC is a new open standard for high performance compute modules. It's the next evolution of ComExpress, except that it uses higher end CPUs, has more memory, and uses next generation super speed I.O. and of course lots more of that I.O. It's targeting emerging markets like 5G, AI, big data, and IoT. ComHPC comes in two major flavors, server and client. Today, I'd like to focus on the server type. The ComHPC server has 64 lanes of PCIe Gen 5, eight ports of 25 gig ethernet, and two ports of USB 4. In addition, it beefs up its BMC with a dedicated PCIe lane and an extra IPMB port which gives the ability for advanced remote control and management. Now, right here in front of me is the latest ComHPC server board from Advantic. It's called the SOM8990. As you can see down here, this is the SOM8990 over here, and it's a, a size E type, which is the largest type you can get, and it measures 200 by 160 millimeters. It comes equipped with a Skylake DCPU, with up to 16 cores. It's got up to 512 gig of DDR4 memory split over these eight DIMMs, naturally supporting ECC or not supporting. 46 PCIe Gen 3 lanes, the beefed up BMC, four ports of 10 gigabit ethernet, gigabit ethernet port, SATA 3, USB 2, USB 3. It supports TPM 2.0 and has your regular usual SMBAS, GPIO, I2C and COM ports. Now, if you have a close look here at these screws, Advantech have cleverly redesigned the mechanical mounts here so that it provides easier assembly of the cooling solution. And it also makes the whole thing a lot more, has a, has a higher thermal performance and it prevents PCB bending. Now, especially with the CPU, which is mounted on here, which is a, an Intel Xeon D2183IT running at 2.2 gigahertz regular, turbo speed 3.0 gigahertz. It's got 16 cores and its TDP is running at around 100 watts. Now, Advantech offer two thermal solutions here, a low profile solution, and of course, this high performance solution with a cooling fan. Now, as you can tell, the SOM8990 is mounted on a carrier board. Now this carrier board, also from Advantech, is called the SOM DB8900. DB stands for Development Board. Now I'll just run you through some of the IOs. We'll start off with the PCIe. Here you can see we've got a by 16 slot, two slots of by 8, two slots of by 4, and up here in the corner we have three more slots of by 4 PCIe running at Gen 3. So that's plenty of room for expansion. Moving along, along here, you can see we've got two ports of SATA 3. We have over here an M2B key, an M2E key, and two M2M keys. Over here is where the two COM ports are. These OCP connectors here hold our four ports of 10 gig Ethernet running on KR, obviously. Here we have uh, GPIOs coming out. Uh, SM bus connector over here. Here's all our power connectors. There's the beefed up BMC with the extra connections. And if I show you down here on the front panel, you'll see we have two ports of USB 3, two ports of gigabit ethernet, two ports of USB 2, a COM port here for the old timers, a VGA port for video out. And here's the nice surprise. What we have here is two ports of USB 4 using a Type-C connector. With the Advantech SOM8990 and the DB8900, you can start your ComHPC evaluation right away 